Hey guys, I'm so excited to be participating in DIY Mommy's Christmas DIY and Decor Challenge. I will put a link to her channel below. She has fantastic DIYs, decor videos, anything of that sort. You're sure to find something that you like. So today, it's simply a collab, either a Christmas DIY, how you decorate your house for Christmas, Anything pretty much goes. I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how I made this awesome beachy themed Christmas tree ornament and This super cute shell Christmas tree if you guys think they're adorable as much as I do then stay tuned Thanks so much for watching Okay guys, so for the first DIY I have one of these plain plastic DIY ornaments from Dollar Tree, decorative sand, glitter, something to mix the two in, some shells, and a little decorative twine, kitchen twine, rope, something of that sort. Yeah, you're sniffing the stuff. Are you helping? Yes, you're going to do the helping. Okay, thank you. I've laid out some of my shells. I've got my Mod Podge, and I've got my glitter. So I am going to coat my shells with a thin layer of that and sprinkle with a little bit of this just for a little extra sparkle and luster. You can set this to the side to dry. Go ahead and do some more and I'll check back with you guys in a second. My decorative sand, just going to mix in a little glitter, mix that around. If you have a funnel, it's a perfect time to use one. I don't, so I have made one with a sheet of paper. Just gonna pour my sand in now. Probably gonna add just a little bit more. I've added a little more sand to the ornament. I'm gonna go ahead and start dropping my shells in there. I have a few sand dollars that I collected on a vacation we went on last year. Put those in there. As well as some of the smaller shells that I've gone ahead and glittered. I also picked up this small bag of shells that I think would be absolutely perfect for this project. I've dropped my shells in. It's starting to look so cute. Also, if you guys have any sea glass, that would be a perfect addition to this. I do not, but I happen to have this old belt and I've been eyeing this little piece, so I am gonna take this off. I'm gonna open the jump ring. Found an old Ziploc bag. I'm just gonna put it in there, wrap it around. See if I can break it up with this hammer. I spared you guys the noise, but check it out. It actually worked, so I'm gonna toss a couple of these in there too. I think that added a nice touch. It gives just a little pop of color. Before I add the top back on, I'm actually gonna add a little bit of Mod Podge around the top of the ornament just to make sure that it's nice and secure. Next, guys, I am actually going to paint a little circle of more Mod Podge around the top. And I have some twine. I'm actually going to go around the top with my twine. As you're wrapping it around, just add extra glue as you need it. Super cute, very easy. If you guys know anyone that's into beach decor, nautical things, this would make a perfect gift. 
lovely easy DIY. So I'm just going to tie some twine on the top and it will be ready to go. Up, I am actually going to make a Christmas tree. I grabbed this Christmas tree styrofoam form from Dollar Tree. I was hoping to grab different sizes. This was the only one they had available, so this is what we're working with for now. I've got my shells and I've got my handy dandy glue gun. We're gonna go to town, continue with our beachy coastal Christmas theme here, and start decorating this bad boy with some shells. I have the shells that you guys saw earlier that I went ahead and glittered. Some of them are plain. I still have my small ones here to fill in if there's any spaces. But I also have these shells that I've been holding onto for a while from when I used to make jewelry. Super pretty, pearl essence, little bits there, and these gorgeous iridescent shells here. These little iridescent shells as well to fill in where I have any small spaces or gaps. I have no strategy. I'm just gonna place these as I see fit. If I had more time, I'd probably use the E6000 because it will actually last longer. But for now, this is what we're doing. I don't know if this is gonna work. This is what I have so far. I'm trying to get the shell smaller as I'm working my way towards the top to give it a more tree-like appearance. Hey guys, this is the finished product. So fun creating this. I am so thrilled with how it turned out. I am absolutely loving it. <laughs>